200 families in rural Uganda are now entrepreneurs. They're in the dairy goat business. They're able to generate a stable income, get better nutrition, send their children to school, and take control of their destiny. This transformation was made possible by the generous attendees of the 2012 Event Profit Secrets event. Together, these sassies helped us raise nearly $112,000 in funding for our Project Grace Microenterprise Program. Now we're rolling up our sleeves and starting to work in Senegal, West Africa. The country of Senegal in West Africa is a land rich in beauty, art, music, and tradition. There are miles of beautiful white sandy beaches, but at one time these ocean shores made Senegal an ideal location for a robust slave trade. In fact, it was the epicenter of this brutal commerce. Hundreds of thousands of the country's strongest perished in slave prisons before even leaving their homeland. Today, Senegal is a peaceful democratic country, but one that has been plagued by severe poverty. 90% of the population are farmers, dependent on a rainy season that takes place over the summer. With such a short rainy season and the lack of irrigation, food often runs out the following spring, a time unfortunately known as the hunger season. Last year, the rainy season started late and ended early, making this a perilous year for starvation. The World Bank and many NGOs are braced for potential famine in Senegal. When food becomes scarce and farmers have nothing to sell, Healthcare, education, and ability to grow a business is marginalized. But the people of Senegal never lose their vibrancy. Color, music, dance, and celebration are everywhere. In the village of Kershaik, where Just Like My Child has begun working, women are ready to get up and take control of their own destiny. They're eager for investments of water, access to healthcare, and education. Just Like My Child is bringing the boots on the ground experience we've earned in Uganda to make a difference for hundreds of families in Senegal. We work closely with the community members of Kershake to implement our Project Grace Microenterprise program. A $50,000 investment will pave the way for hundreds of women to become entrepreneurs by providing an irrigation system that allows them to raise and sell crops. This, in turn, will help them to pay for their children's school fees and the investment will also provide funding for women to receive family planning and prenatal care. When women in the developing world have fewer children, they stay stronger and their children are healthier and better educated. I like my school. And that makes for a better future for all of us.